guys doing? I hope you guys are all doing well. Today, I believe it is April 3rd, I believe, 2019. And I am here to do another what I bought for my eBay store. Okay, first let me show you the things that I got for myself. These are going to be for me. I found this hat for the beach. I used to have one and it just, it fell apart and I used it for several years and uh, I take it to the beach. This was uh, half off, everything white tag was half off. So um, yeah, I haven't cleaned it or anything, but how's that? Eh, for the beach, I think that's really, really good. What do you think? It's really, it's really, really wide. Like it's really wide. So I got that guys. I'm ready to go to the beach here. Yeah, okay, let me show you the next thing I got for myself. I've been borrowing my mom's little, sh like a shrug, and I found this one yesterday. Now this is a large, I think this is gonna be a little snug for me, but I don't know, I, I just liked it. It's a knit, or yeah, a knit shrug. Um, this is from uh, Quest, is it Quest Design by Say What? Uh, yeah, and it was also white tagged, so got that half off as well. And then finally, I picked this up. I just love the color. I don't think it's going to fit me, at least not this second, not right now. But I just really liked the green and the uh, rose pattern. Are they roses? No, huh? Yeah, they're roses. Um, the peach sort of tone roses and the green. This is a uh, sleeveless, but I think it's so pretty. It's like a, what do they call this? A blo blos blossom, Bla blousen, a blousen, I think it's what they're calling it. Anyway, look at that. I just thought it was pretty. Um, and this is from um, A New Day. This one was $3.99, but I just loved it. I just thought it was so pretty. And yeah, maybe even with this, like you could put these two together, maybe, I don't know. So that is all that I picked up for myself. So let me take this hat off. <laughs> all right, guys. Now, as far as clothing goes, I picked this one here. This is from Croft and Barrow, and this is uh, Cole's brand, and it's brand new. It's a squirt. It's brand new, still has the tags from Kohl's. And uh, they were $36 and they were on clearance for $10.80. Um, I do really, really good with squirts from, from Kohl's, the Croft and, the Croft and Barrow uh, brand. I do really, really good, especially plus size. Smaller sizes, four, six, and eight, and even tens, I don't personally do too good with those sizes. But I figured because this is denim and I've never sold a denim squirt before, I figured this might do really good. We will see. Be interesting to see. But my experience with plus sizes in that style, I do really, really good. The other thing I picked up was this Gymboree gold vest. I picked that one up and uh, there is a little bit of a red stain right here. There you go. Um, I'm going to try to clean it and remove it. If I can't, it will go back and I will leave the tag still on there. So I'm going to try to do some spot cleaning to it and see if I can get that out. It, it's iffy right now, I'm not quite sure, but there's no snag to this and it's actually in, other than that, it's in pretty, pretty good condition. I just don't know if it will sell with that red stain. I, I just, it's tough, it's tough. A lot of times the condition of the items really need to be great um, because they just won't sell. Here's another beautiful Easter dress that I picked up. This is from Jonah Michelle. Did I tell you this was from the Gymboree? And this one here, this squirt here is a size uh, six. A size six. I thought I said maybe four, but it's a six. And this is from the Gymboree, and this is a small five, six vest. And this one is from Jonah Michelle. This is a size five. 
and this is really 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 cute really cute love the colors the blue the white and the yellow with the polka dots really pretty and I know this one will go um, the other thing I picked up now this I paid regular price for it it was not on sale this one here was a white tag which I was surprised that I actually found this one um, this is from um, Tough Skins, um, which is what, Sears, I believe? But it's a snowsuit. It's a snowsuit, and uh, it's really amazing condition. I'm not sure if this was even worn. Really, it is just amazing, amazing condition. So I picked that up. And this, again, I did get this at the 50% sale. That was all the clothes that I picked up. Shoes. These, I'm not sure if these are going to do good. I'm not. Uh, I've never sold anything, I don't believe I have, from Montego Bay. These were made in, I think it was Brazil. Oops, sorry. I think that's, let me see. Made in, made in Brazil. Yeah, Brazil. Um, I think these were might have been used one time, maybe. I think just one time. A lot of traction still left. There's the footbed still looks really, really nice. Uh, this is rubber. This whole shoe is rubber. Uh, this is a size, a US 11. Um, this is going to be a chance uh, to see how these go. I'm gonna clean them up and uh, we'll see how they go. I hope they do really, really good. I think they will. I think they will do good. I like the pattern. I like how different they are. I did look them up on eBay. I didn't see anything uh, at the time I, you know, yesterday when I looked it up, I didn't see anybody have anything like this. They are kind of all over the place. So some Montego Bays have some really good resale value. Some of them, not so much. Okay, the other pair of shoes were these uh, aerosols. These are brand new. Uh, as you can see, they still have the store elastic, even the tag from the store. Uh, no wear to them at all. These feel so, so comfortable. They're so super, super soft as aerosols, aerosols, aerosols are. Um, oh, why is the tag? This is the bottom of the shoe tag. Um, this is, uh, this is, uh, a pearlescent pattern, uh, um, what do I want to say? Vinyl plastic, but it has a pearlescent finish to it, which is kind of nice, really nice. And then it has these sort of detail here, plastic detail, but yeah, I think these will do good size eight. I think these will do good. Um, I, you know, being that it's brand new, summertime is coming. You know, it's a very, it's a neutral color, so it could go with anything. So I think these will really, really do good for me. So these, that was a really good find. So the other shoes that I got were these here from Style and Company. Um, these I did get uh, half off. Look at the blue and the white and the. Um, aqua and teal these are like a satin finish with a uh, open toe um nice good heel <laughs> and um yeah i was really excited to have found these the condition of these are awesome awesome condition the thing of it is is that um i know styling company what's that um is that Coles? that is Coles. i think they sell it at Coles. Um, and this particular style does really, really well. Well, from what I saw the comps on it, they do pretty good. So we will see, hopefully these will go for some good, some good profit for me. Okay. The other ones that I found that I also got, um, uh, for a 50% off because it was a white tag are these, uh, Dex Flex Comfort. Now I have sold Dex Flex Comfort before. They have done really good. Now, not like a tremendous amount of profit, but for what I got them for and for what I think they could go for, it seems like it's gonna give me a good return. Um, but these are, again, patent leather, very neutral color, open toe. The 
footbed has still a lot of cushion in it. Um, I don't know if they even wore these a whole heck of a lot. The heel still looks really, really, really good. So yeah, these are another ones that um, I'll just clean up, disinfect, and get up right away because this color I think does it really, really good in the spring and in the summer. Now these I've never heard of. Um, these are, let's see, where were they? These are We Kids Walk. We Kids Walk. Now I didn't even tell you the sizes of these. So, so sorry. These uh, are a size seven. These were a size seven. And these are a size, uh, what size are you? What size are you? <laughs> um, I don't know. Oh, there it is. Whew, that would scare me because it's hard to sell anything if you don't have the size to them. A size seven and a half. These are seven and a half. And these were a size eight. So these here, uh, brand new, brand new, very cute sort of boat shoes for kids. Uh, very nice plaid design inside, boat shoe outside um, from We Kids. And these are a size, um, size four, nine to 12 months. I have never sold anything from this brand. Um, I did look it up a little bit there at the thrift store and um, seems to be a very good brand, seems to sell. Uh, I don't have a lot of luck with boy shoes. I just don't, but I'm hoping for a good return um, on these because they were brand new. So I was willing to take that chance. And then lastly, as far as shoes go, this is the last thing I have. I was kind of really excited to have found these. These are really cute wedges. They're a suede material. Um, they have these studs here on the sides. These are from Nicole Miller. Look at the wear on them. Hardly any wear at all. Um, really nice. Very, very, very nice. They do really well. They do really, really well. So, yeah. And these are a size eight and a half. Yeah, eight and a half B, which is medium, medium width. Really excited for these. I think they're cute, very nice. So I got those. And lastly, I picked up, I know you're gonna be like, what? I picked up this sort of TV tray, dinner tray for $1.99. Um, what I needed, the, it was so funny because I had just told my husband I did some pictures this weekend and one of the things that I struggle with is shoes in terms of to take pictures because I like to do it back here but I do need a table. I do have a table over there but it's, it's big. It's really, really big and to pull it all the time, it's cumbersome but I need a small table that I can fold and put behind my dresser that is right here underneath the TV. And I could just slide it in and out when I'm doing pictures for, for my shoes. And I told my husband, I really would like one of those trays that you fold, those small little TV trays. <laughs> and that's what I found yesterday, unbelievable. So what I'm going to do uh, is I'm going to go either to Dollar Tree, I did go yesterday to the Dollar Tree to try to find some, uh, oops, sorry, like the shelf liners, <laughs> to try to find a white one. I need something white, something with not a lot of design. And they didn't have, at the Dollar Tree that I went to last night before we came home, didn't have any. Uh, but I can also go to like Home Depot and maybe get like those peel off tiles and put it on top. And that's what I'm going to be doing with this one instead of trying to paint it or whatever. I'm just going to tile tile the, um, the, the, the top here, white. And this is exactly what I needed. So I just pull this, little table out when I'm doing shoes and slide it back in when I'm done. And this is exactly, this is exactly what I was picturing when I was talking to my husband about it. And there it was. <laughs> and for $1.99, I think that's a pretty good investment. 
Anyways, guys, that is it. I just yapped it up. I will be doing another haul for you here right now. As soon as I finish here, um, I'm going to be showing you guys a couple of things that I have picked up in terms of helping me, uh, in terms of supplies to better clean my products and things like that. Um, and I'll share, uh, what I picked up in that video and how I'm going to house my stuff. Okay, you guys, uh, that is it. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys are enjoying these uh, types of videos. Um, I'll be having a lot more. I seen a, the way other YouTubers do their eBay and their Poshmark and how they budget themselves. I'm learning how to really realistically go out and source a lot. Some of them source two, three times a week. Some of them source per month, X amount of time. It just depends if they have, you know, help to be able to do this, um, and things like that. So I'm going to really sit down and put myself on a budget, but until then, um, yeah, I will keep you guys updated on everything and how I'm going to start doing this. All right, my friends, let me let you go. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys very, very soon. All right. Bye.